Oh, hi, hello there. Uh, I'm here at McDowell Community College, and I was just, uh, well, I was dumpster diving. Do you know there's all kinds of things you can do with bottles? Oh, hey, 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 bring that, bring that bottle. Hey, hey, I want the bottle. Here's a cool project that's pretty fun that even the kids can do. It's uh, as easy as taking a two-liter bottle, um, you know, two-liter soda bottle, and um, what I did is I cut a slit around the bottom of the bottle, um, leaving just enough to kind of give it a flap so it's kind of easy to tuck back over. All right, and then taking paper and a little bit of rubber cement, and I chose rubber cement because once you take the image off, it wipes clean. You can adhere different shapes to it, which will kind of serve as a, um, an image that will show the light through where the rest will be opaque. Once you have your image placed down, take spray paint, or if you're willing to give that a try, use craft paint to cover the entire two liter bottle. Once that's done, just as easy as removing your shapes and wiping that rubber cement away. And um, what I did here is I uh, filled the bottom with pennies, but you can use sand or anything else to just kind of weigh your bottle down. And to kind of hide this nasty, uh, this nasty slice right across here, I, um, I took leaves from a reef, or you can, you know, take some fabric from around the house to just kind of cover it up and serve as a base. Also, to keep things from getting too hot in there, I found this, found this cool LED light that changes to different kinds of colors and, and different shapes and things. And um, you can find these at just about any hardware store, or um, most retailers carry these cool little LED lights. Hello. My projects this year for this contest have been kid-oriented. I've taken three Coke bottles, or two, one Coke bottle, and turned him into our favorite pumpkin here. He's split in half, and he's been glued back together and decorated up for the harvest season. This is a ketchup bottle that I've reused. Very easy. Punch a couple holes through the cap, fill it with water, and you've got your automatic watering system for your planter, which has been made out of milk jugs. There's other options also available to kids constantly. Let me show you how to make the planter real quick. What you're going to do is take your planter that you've decorated up real pretty with flowers and whatnot, just a little bit of paint and glue, works wonders. Then you're going to fill it up with some soil and you're going to add your plants. Makes a great household item and a great kid's item. Kids can do this real easily. Only thing I ask is that when you cut them down to size, that you make sure an adult does it rather than the kids. Sharp objects and such. But the kids love the idea of playing in the dirt and planting their flowers. And as thus. Once you get totally planted, all the way around, you just water them up and you've got your automatic planter out of a milk jug. These things are really easy to use, quick, simple, kids, church projects. You can also use a leftover kitchen item, which would be a frosting jar. Makes a great piggy bank for kids. Always think about the future and what your kids will have. Recycle whenever possible. People in the U.S. throw away 2.5 million plastic bottles per hour. Only 10% of that is recycled. The other 90% goes to landfills. It can take up to 700 years for plastic bottles to begin to dissolve and um, to decompose in a landfill. Recycled plastic can be used in many products. Help, Help the, the environment, save energy, and, and preserve the health of humans and wildlife.